according to legend, a really good blast of air should be able to bring down a house of straw. Let's see how it goes with an explosively generated vortex ring. Here goes. This is the gas. It's the first time it's ever been fired, and with 150 litres of one of the world's most explosive gas mixes in there, I'm not even sure that this is really a safe place to stand. Seems about right. I'm going to need these, I reckon. Here we go. Three, two, one. Call me hopeful, but there was definitely something there. But was it a vortex ring? Filmed at 1300 frames per second, there is no doubt. But the ring you can see is not a smoke ring. It's formed by the pressure drop within the vortex, condensing the water out of the damp air above the lake. A 200 mile an hour cloud. Bring on the sticks and bricks. Three, two, one. What? Yes! Fantastic! Well, it makes mincemeat of a house of sticks. Bring on the bricks. Even in fairy stories, they couldn't get a blast of air to knock down a house of bricks. We're heading into the world of the unknown a little bit, so we've got to experiment. We're going to try changing the elevation on it, changing the gas mix in there, see if we get a perfect gas mix. So that's just the right amount of molecules of acetylene reacting with just the amount of molecules of oxygen in the air. So there's no passengers in there, it's got to be all explosion. Let's see how that goes. Three, two, one. Ah, hey! Yes! That's incredible! That was amazing. I so.